Hey guys, I wanted to come on here. I want to bring you guys more mindset content because I feel like I really specialize in those kinds of things. I've been able to turn people into uh, six-figure earners very easily. Um, and a lot of it is mindset, you know, because I see a lot of people quit, especially in my industry. In general, you know, people quit fast. They quit way too fast. And there's certain things that guides people that I want to tell you about here. So let me just um, read this. One of my Facebook friends says, the excuse that you are using to explain why you are poor and unsuccessful is the exact same excuse someone used as the reason to become wealthy. Now let's dive, dive deeper into this. What is your excuse? Think about it. What is your excuse? Is it, I'm not, you know, whatever. I'm not confident enough. I don't have enough money. I don't blah, blah, blah. I'm not clever enough. I'm not what? I'm, I'm not an extrovert. What is it? These same excuses. Let me tell you this one thing about success. Success is very linear. It's different than having a great relationship because there's an art to having a good relationship. Like there's an art to that. But success is very linear. If you do A plus B, you will get C. If you do one, two, three, four, five, six, you will get the goal. And that's the one thing about success that I can account for that in any industry I've ever been in, things come down to, can you take the steps, take the action, do it enough times, get good enough to get it done and have a successful result. That simple. Now, there will be times when you don't feel like it. There will be times when you are feeling like shit. There'll be times when you're hurt. There'll be times when you feel alone. And there's certain things that you need to take and take this complaint, this insecurity, these certain things about yourself, take these complaints and bring them across the, the bring them across, get across the river, no, get across the lake with these motivations. You know, they say you can't, they say use the motivation to get across the lake, but you can't use the same motivation to go further. So in every, so basically what I'm trying to say is in every instance, there's a motivation that you can use to get across. For me, um, I'm building my, I'm building my, well, how many streams of income do I have? I'm building my third stream of income and the way that I'm the way that I'm thinking about it is I'm like, man, I want this stream of income to pay for my whole life. I don't want to touch I don't want to touch any of those funds from my other two businesses. I just don't want to touch any of them. Nothing. So I have to get it to where that I'm making a certain amount of money per month per year so that I can truly live the life that I want. And I know that if I do this, it will help me. And when it comes to accounting and a lot of different things, this will help me become a better person. This will help me become more solid. So this is my motivation. Like my motivation is like, yo, I got to make a certain amount of money to fund my life with this second uh, stream of income so that I can live the life that I want. And I'm just tired of living off my other businesses. Now I could easily live off of them, but I just don't want to anymore. Because if I use, when I use those other funds, 
to fund my life, that takes away from that business truly building phenomenally. So that is why I'm building this income. And that is why, actually these two incomes, I'm building these two incomes. So that is why I'm doing what I'm doing. And what I'm telling myself is, yo, I'm sick of it. I want to get this third, second and third stream of income up and going and roaring, finally. And that is my motivation. Now, you can see how once I get across the lake, once I hit this goal, I'm gonna probably have to come up with another motivation so that I can keep going. But this is what I know I want. This is my short-term goal. I know exactly how I'm gonna get there, what I have to do every single day. And I'm gonna do it. And I'm very, very motivated. And I, I swear to God, I will do it. I promise you. So I'm gonna even, I'm going to even make a, uh, make a prediction right now so that, and you guys can keep me accountable to this. What's the, um, it is, it's gonna be August soon. By the end of the year, this is bold. By the end of the year, I'm gonna be completely living off of my second and third stream of income. Completely. Guarantee it. And I'm gonna be living well off of it. And I promise that, and that's my new goal. And I'm just tired. I'm honestly, I'm just tired of only having one stream of income. I'm tired of it. Now I live a great life. I've been traveling the world for two years. But this is the next level. I know that I want this. And anyways, see you guys later.